Tagalog. Basic Tagalog. <laughs> Maganda. Maganda. Gusto ko. Gusto ko. Napakaganda. What? It's super ganda. Not. Just said super ganda. Super ganda. <laughs> Napakaganda. Not. Kanda. Bling bling. Bling bling. Bling bling. <laughs>
we're gonna later we're gonna go back in with the, the yellow to kind of blend the two colors i'm gonna blend this in blending is key man i'm gonna add a bit more just pack it on there you know and blend it out again you know i'm gonna take another um brush pencil brush a bigger fluffy one i'm gonna take that one and then i'm gonna take macchiato and this is to intensify and darken my outer corner then i'm gonna blend it just with the brush itself i'm gonna tap off the excess and blend it in And then I'm gonna go back in with this brush where we blended the light out with just this edge right here. Remember, blending is key. Cover key. So now I'm gonna go back in with a little bit of the yellow. Yeah, I brought the light a bit up and then just blending this out. Then going back in with macchiato. I'm gonna do the other eye real quick and I'll see you later. Let's just do mercy on my eyelid. I'm gonna use my ring finger for that. This space here, we're just gonna leave that empty for... She got money. I'm gonna take the... This, this here. <laughs> I'm gonna blend that edge right here. I'm just going back and forth and that's it she got money i'm gonna apply it right here and i'm just gonna blend it into the mercy to kind of get rid of the edge just lightly blend it in then take a bit more and now i'm gonna like pat it and kind of make like blending movements into the mercy i'm just gonna lightly fan that away oh it worked i'm gonna use a small brush for this one taking budding moving on to the lower lash line i'm gonna use period period and using the morphe pencil brush applying that on the lower lash line and try to connect the lower lash line to the eyeshadow from here. Oh my god, I used all the colors! Oh. Alright, I'm going back in with Badin. Badin to my brow bone. Just to complete the eyeshadow. I'm gonna apply a little bit of Shiga Money and really put it on the high. Like the corner right here. Yes. Yes! Sir! I'm gonna do the other eye real quick and I'll be back with you. So I did the other eye. Now that the eyeshadow is done, because everything is about the eyeshadow of course, I'm just gonna skip through uh, the lashes and all of that and I'll see you later. Alright, my lips. What did I use on my lips? Uh, the Kat Von D Ludwig and over top Holographic Lip Topper by B in Unicorn. Now let's get wet. All right, I'm back and I made myself very like beachy and my hair is very textured and curly and you know wavy and I'm gonna switch these first one is called finished holy moly that's a white blue the next color in the palette is I'm chilling well that feels very Next one is low. I'm crying. Let's see if I would cry. Yeah, 
that's a very very nice car lol i'm crying skinny legend that's a very nice skin tone color next one is mood let's see if this brings me in the mood Can you, do you see this? Fishy. Reminds me a bit of the MAC brown blue. Thickens. This color, oh my god. When he swatched it on his uh, arm, oh my god. It feels so smooth. <gasps> Would you look at that? Last but not least, Ewa Beach. Ewa. We use that word also here in the Netherlands. It's like Ewa. Like, what's up? I'm not sure. I'm still kind of white, so I don't use that word. <laughs> let's get started with the look. Still don't know what I'm gonna do, but let's just do it. First, I'm starting off with Skinny Legend using that as a transition color, but it turns out that it was actually my skin tone color. So I'm just applying that to make it smoother base and it's easier for application then I'm taking Ewa Beach and darkening up the transition color yeah I'm doing a voiceover because I'm I talk too much <laughs> taking another blending brush and taking I'm chilling I'm chilling and applying that in the outer corner and also uh, I'm gonna blend that out, but also I'm gonna apply that in my inner corner because my idea was that I am gonna make it a spotlight eye, I think. Yeah. So I'm connecting the outer corner to the inner corner and just blending and blending just that edge right there. Then I'm taking fishy and apl I applied it with the brush, but it didn't really work, so I just used my finger. Um, and really focus that color on the outer corner only. Uh, my mirror was the whole time in front of it, so yeah. Then I'm taking Mood, and then I did use a brush because I really wanted to to apply that really on that. Yeah, if I use my finger, it will not be like this because I, I just needed a small space. Um, yeah, so then I'm turning over the brush and using fishy for that So you don't have to use another color and it's also very good for blending so you can switch sides every time Then I'm taking thickens of course and It just feels like it's so wet or something. It's just a very beautiful color so I just applied that really on the center and then I took the blending brush from Ewa Beach, I think, yeah. And then I just blended the top right there. Then I'm taking the brush again with the Mood and Fishy. And I just blended the thickums to the Mood color. Then I'm taking Lol, I'm crying. And just apply that right uh, there. <laughs> You can see kind of what I'm doing. <laughs> then I'm taking I'm chilling and really apply that there in the inner corner to complete all the colors. And I think my challenge ac actually really worked because I used every color. Yeah, so I just blended the edge out as you can see. Then I'm taking I'm chilling, applying that on my lower lash line. And I took this angled fluffy brush so it looks more smoky. Then I'm taking finished in my inner corner. As you can see, this color like really it blended so good into the I'm chilling. Yeah, it's a very nice color this one. Then I'm taking a very smaller brush and using thickums on my lower lash line on the center. <laughs> Finished right here on the brow bone and on the highest point of my brow bone I added um, thickens, lashes, mascara, 
all that things and I'll come back to you then for lips I use a lime crime in uh, lime crime diamond crushes yeah and then color star gloss design and oh my god all right guys thank you for watching Bretman your palettes are amazing uh, I wish I had the rest of your collection um, yeah maybe in the future you'll be coming out with more things so I'm looking forward to that these were the two palettes I love them I'm very impressed with them looking forward to make more looks of these palettes yeah I hope you enjoyed please subscribe and like this video and comment down below if you're here, if you're like, what's up? I love Bradman. If you're a fan of Bradman and Colourpop, please comment. Um, I'll see you. See you later. <laughs> Bye.